dear friends today i am going to introduce a mongolian based fish curry so i here took one kg of uh, fish that is sea fish i didn't get sardine instead of sardine i took uh, uh, another fish that is in local language called as bhatmati and for that let us check out the ingredients so one kg of fish that is bhatmati and one small coconut grated and i here took 25 number of red chilies based on your taste you can increase and decrease the number of red chilies and a small lemon sized tamarind this is fried coriander that is fried in oil most important thing is this is the black pepper fenugreek seed and mustard seed first we will fry the black pepper in a little of little of oil then when it, when the aroma comes let's add the fenugreek seed then a little then fry a little after that add the mustard seed when it pours take it let's make the masala first for this masala we'll take all the ingredients in a let's do the masala for masala we'll take that grated coconuts red chili and the tamarind into a mixer and grind let's add little water look now the grinding part is over look all the grated coconut red chilies and tam few people were thinking about why i have not added all the ingredients only the three things i have took for grinding for first that is because the coconut it will take some time for it will take some time for smoothing so once the all the coconut and the other ingredients got smooth then we will add the rest of the ingredients it is coriander i took here 3 tablespoon then again we will grind it now all the coriander seed has been mixed now again we will add the last and the topmost ingredients now the masala is ready now let us see how we will prepare the curry i took the masala in an earth pot add a little water based on the consistency you can add the water if you want add as add the salt to taste the masala should not be too thick or too thin will be now keep the masala for boiling let it boil now it's boiling fully now let's add the fishes into it let's mix it like this keep it for a while for the fish to be cooked uh. curry now the curry has been cooked fully now, now the curry has been cooked fully now we have reached the final part we'll add coconut oil at the top now your mangalore and base fish curry is ready